Twas the day before Christmas, and Santa was ill. In the cold winter wind, he had caught a bad chill. Will Christmas be canceled? Will it come to that? Never! Cried Santa. Let's call Pete the Cat. Santa asked Pete to deliver the toys to all the good girls and to all the good boys. I'll do it, said Pete. And although I am small, at Christmas we give, so I'll give it my all. Give it your all. Give it your all. Give it your all. Give it your all. At Christmas we give. Jumped in his mini bus and started to roll. Road trip! cried Pete. First stop, the North Pole. The reindeer were waiting to give Pete a tow, so he packed up the presents and told them to go. Then the mini bus flew, just like in a movie. Pete the cat cried, "This is totally groovy. I can do it," said Pete. And although I am small. At Christmas we give, so I'll give it my all. Give it your all. Give it your all. Give it your all. Give it your all. At Christmas we give. At Christmas we give. So give it your all. So give it your all. As the children were sleeping all snug in their beds, Pete and his reindeer appeared overhead. Straight down the chimney, Pete flew in a dash. Then back in his mini bus, quick as a flash. Each time he delivered a holiday gift, he crossed off a name written on Santa's list. Santa's list was so big, and Pete felt so small. But at Christmas we give, so he gave it his all. Give it your all. At the very last minute, they reached the last house. Pete dashed in and out, just as quiet as a mouse. Then, right at the break of the new Christmas day, Pete and his reindeer were flying away. Back at the North Pole, old Santa was waiting. The elves and the town folk were all celebrating. Santa was dressed in his red coat and hat and cried, "Hip, hip, hooray for our friend Pete the Cat!" I did it," said Pete. And although I am small, in the spirit of Christmas, I gave it my all. Give it your all. Give it your all.